Yes. You remember me? Or maybe not, whatever. My name is Josip. So, we have patient here. He needs medicine. No problem. But Garrett there has pills, plenty of them. You ask. And sometime you get in trouble, you find me. I help you. Always good to see you. Si, bueno. I think I know who you are. People are talking about you. Muy bien. If you ever need any help, come find me. My name is Guillen. And stay away from the factions. They're animals both sides. Oh, you people never stop. Here's the bloody tape, all right? That's it. That's all I've got. Well, aren't you going to destroy it? That's what your friends usually do. Wait, you're not here for the tapes, are you? Well, I see the problem now. You can get the pills you need from the church in Pala. The priest there will help you, assuming you make it in time. Just passes along for me. You can't break a man the way you break a dog or a horse. The harder you beat a man, the top. So you're not one of them. I'm Ruben Oluagenbi, what you call a stringer. And you are new, I can tell by the state of your clothes. They're much too clean. You're taking a chance talking to me. I'm persona non grata around here. The warlords want me out of the country. They don't like the story I'm writing. It's about the war, and about them, of course. But mostly it's about the famous arms dealer, the Jaka. That was him on the tape. Do you know I have covered 16 wars across Africa? 16. And every time he has been there, selling his weapons and making a fortune while millions of people suffer and die. He thinks he can continue to do his work in secret. But not this time. These stories, they are going to come out. The Jackers, the Warlords, the Soldiers, the Boy Soldiers, even the NGOs. I intend to expose the whole sordid mess. I make it sound very dramatic. We'll see if anybody back home even notices. I've been interviewing people for months now. Diplomats, Warlords, civilians, wherever I could trick into talking to me. I had some fantastic material. Then the Soldiers confiscated my tapes. They said they destroyed them. But maybe not. I don't know. I can't very well go looking for them. I'm no good with a gun, you see. And you need one these days just across the street. You've seen the fighting. The war is getting worse by the minute. It's absurd. Because why are they fighting? For what? You can see the country is destroyed. The people, the diamonds, the cities. But about the rages on with the Jackers' weapons, no less. It is going to end badly. And I'm afraid I'll be here to see it. I'm a bit of a robber neck, I suppose. Listen, if you find any more of my tapes, please bring them back to me here at the bar. I need them for my story. I'll tell you right now, I can't pay you. I can only offer you my worthless friendship in return. This area is under siege part, not this part. It's Docker with a deal better. What's he doing now? Chaplain wanted his confession to not only agrees to fit the fight, which of course not the other first. Not what he likes it. So he grabbed the wheelbarrow and filled it with local currency. Absolutely stuffed it. Filled I'm sorry, there aren't the regular the services at the moment. Oh, you're not well. You should see a doctor before you really need a priest. Did Ruben send you? He had something for me. I would be very happy to give you what little medicine I have in exchange. I think I should take it. 
take one of those right away. Those will only left. I don't know where to get more. Not all of my people have left. Many are trapped, scared of what will happen if they are caught trying to leave. And there are others who have chosen to stay. We try to help where we can, and we could use someone like you. You should come back when you require more medicine. 